And it would appear we'll have a pinch hitter here to start things out in the bottom of the inning. Ladies and gentlemen, your attention please. Pinch hitting for the Marlins. Number 69, Eddie Jay. A swing and a drive sent out toward the gap. Make the turn here. But Make that'll the turn. be off the wall in right center. And the Marlins have something cooking. It's a leadoff double. Hey, after that hit right there, Dero, that extends his hitting streak to six games. Yeah, no doubt about it. Six days in a row with knocks will help you sleep better at night, Dan. Hey, get one up there, huh? The batter, number five. Second baseman. Slow roller, left Go. side. Gonna be a tough play. The tag gets one, but he'll put this in his pocket and be content with just the one out. Alex Messia will come on in relief now as he'll make it. Not a lot of fireworks, but that narrows the candidate list for our top player of the game. And the man you see here was a key contributor, so he takes it home in this one. Yeah, no question. He was a tough out up there. Ended up collecting three knocks, including a home run. So without him in the lineup, I think this might have been a different story. Four to two, the final score tonight. The Miami Marlins came through when it mattered in the ninth on the way to the win. Four runs on six hits. One error. They left four men on base. We are under the lights this evening as we get you set for another edition of Baseball on the Show. Coming up, we've got a good matchup in store between the Philadelphia Phillies and the Miami Marlins. Philadelphia attempt to end a six-game losing streak. Next. Eliezer Hernandez, the right-hander from Venezuela, gets the starting nod in this one. Dan Plezak, what's the word on him? Man, this guy was really rock solid in his last one. Eight solid innings in his last start to pick up the win. We'll see if he can keep it going and make it two really good starts in a row. On its way, the 0-1 pitch. This is hit the other way out toward left field. James will get there with ease as he puts it away for route number two. Riding into the box, Eddie James. First chance for him here after appearing as a pinch hitter in the game last night. From the belt, the pitch. Hit hard on the ground towards second. To second for one. On to first as they get the double play to get him out of the inning. So stepping in, Adam Hazley. Couple of hits for him in four trips to the plate last night. Hazley. Smoke the other way, high and deep to left. Left fielder looking up. Out of here, into the visitor's bullpen. When you're facing an elite starter. Stepping up now, Eddie now James. Left He'll swing it from the left side Eddie. right here. Really doesn't matter what side the plate of this guy bats from. He hits very well. He hits right-handed pitching very well. Swinging left-handed and you're swinging scoring, from the right scoring. side against lefties. The number... And we'll have to leave it there as the play is made here. To... Ready once again, Up Eddie James. Marlins. He flew out no in his last field. at bat. Almost, Eddie. Matty. Almost went Eddie. deep. His left is swung on and driven out to right center field. A ball that's well hit. Boom goes the dynamite. Hey, that's the price you pay right there when you try and sneak a fastball past this guy. Power hitter, and every power hitter in the league knows you got to start digging in to try it again. Bryson Stott. He's Second hitless base. in his two at bats right so there. far. Stop. That's lifted the other way out to left. Left fielder is on the move. He makes the catch. Here comes the runner from third. And he is safe at the plate, and that'll cut it to a 7 3 ball game now. Obviously, he's hoping for more up there with the bases loaded, but you can't be too upset with the sack fly. 
leading off for the Marlins. Last half the of the seventh fielder. here, and coming Eddie. forward is the switch hitting Eddie. outfielder, Eddie James. The last at that, Matty D, we heard this guy's a good ball. fastball hitter. He got a fastball and didn't miss it. We'll see if they pitch him a little bit differently this time and mix in some off speed pitches. Chalk up another multi hit game for this guy. He is absolutely on fire. He's been on a nice hot streak as of late, and I don't see it ending anytime soon. Runners off for second. Ground ball sent back up the middle. Fielded cleanly. A tag for one, but he'll put this in his pocket and be content with just the one out. Well, just an excellent job right here closing this one out. He just collected the first save of his career. Got to start somewhere. 7 5 tonight's final. Miami took the lead in the second inning and rode that until the very end. Eliezer Hernandez notches his third win of the year. Aaron Nola was hit hard to the tune of seven earned as he takes the loss. Austin Adams wraps it up for the save, his first of the year. So that just about does it for Mark DeRosa, Dan Plezak, Heidi Watney, and our entire crew. I'm Matt Vasquez, and you've been watching MLB The Show. Tonight. For more, first, make your way the over to theshownation.com. Seven runs, 11 hits, no errors. They left 12 men on base. Afternoon baseball here on the show. Ought to be a good one here between the Philadelphia Phillies and the Miami Marlins. Philadelphia hope to put a lid on their seven-game losing streak coming up next. Nick Neidert gets the ball for Miami in this one. Dan, any thoughts? Hey, we're going to get a chance to look at a guy that uh, he's a little bit up and down throughout points of his career. A career ERA just over four. When he's good, he can be really good. And Swing, high drive, left field and deep. Now a leaping effort at the wall, but he comes up empty. This one is gone. Home run. Yeah, he's looked pretty shaky from the first pitch, and things just kind of spiraled out of control from there. I think these guys smelled blood in the water and they punctuated with a three run job. Next to bat will be Reese Hoskins. A couple of hits for him in four trips to the plate last night. Reese Hoskins. Pulled high in the air out to left field. James is there to put it away and the runner will be forced to retreat back to first. Stepping in, Eddie James, as he'll get his first no opportunity in this one. Eddie James. Attaboy. From the stretch. A swing and a drive sent out toward the gap. And he's going to make the catch on the warning track. A Pick fine the running ball. play Stay there right for the Stay first right out. The bag, and he'll move bag. up to third now. Runners at the corners. Bottom of the inning now, and coming forward is the switch hitting outfielder, Eddie James. Hey, we're still in the early stages in this one. They're only down by a couple of runs, but it's really key for this leadoff guy to try to get on and get a big inning started. Nice hit, big guy, boy. Hey, there's another base knock right there. A hitting streak now up to eight games. Yeah, no doubt about it. Well, eight games. Now, nah, man, we're starting to think about it a little bit. You know, you get past now that bad. week, you just the know you're baseman. locked in. Ryan. They start talking eight games. Andrew. Now you're like, all right, yeah. I got a nice little hit and streak. He's good, he's good. Popped him up. Harper coming on. He gets there to make the play for the first out of the inning. Stepping into the box, Lewin Diaz. Now batting. First baseman, Lewin Diaz. And now they've got him in a rundown. They slap the tag on him, and he is out at second base. Coming to the plate now, Adam Hazley. One for two in the ball game thus far. Adam, Ready to deal. Here's the 2-1. Fly ball out to straightaway left. James comes on now and puts it away for the second out of the inning. Now to the plate, Eddie James. He singled his last time up. Eddie. Yeah, Matty, pressure's off right now. He extended his hitting streak that last plate appearance. Now he gets to get back into his zone, 
work on his craft and try and drive something. Striding in to start the night, Eddie James, and they'll need him to get something going here. He pulls this one high and deep to right center field, and that is off the wall. And he's able to hustle his way up to second as he'll reach here with a two base hit. When you play with fire, you have to expect to get burned once in a while. He's about as hot as you can get right now. They continue to pitch to him, and he continues to make them pay. Nice double off the wall here. Stepping up to the plate, Brian Anderson. He flew out the in his last at bat. Brian Anderson. A 1-1. Hit hard on the ground at first. And a backhanded okay, reach at first, but he can't flag it down. The relay throw. Hey, this might be their best opportunity to at least get on the board. They've been struggling offensively, and they find themselves with two runners on board. Let's see if they can continue it. At the plate, Lewin Diaz, and their runners at the corners now. This is lifted out to left. Mancini is there. Let's see if they try it. And no shot of testing anything there. He'll hold on at third with one gone. Stepping in and ready for another shot, Isan Diaz. Stop. Isan. Diaz. Swing and a miss. A big strikeout, and he's one out away from working out of a jam. In now, Mike Gerber. He comes to the plate as the last chance for his side. Two out here in the ninth. Now a swing, and he pops him up. And this should do it. And he'll make the final out to put an end to this one. And the Phillies have finally found their way back into the win column as this ball game is over. Well, listen, there's no doubt they were pressing during that seven-game losing streak. But that's behind them now. Now they can play a little bit freer, which is the way this game is supposed to be played anyways. 5-0 the final score today. The Philadelphia Phillies hosted a three-run first to propel them to the win. Zach Wheeler earns win number four on the season. So that just about does it for Mark DeRosa, Dan Plezak, Heidi Watney, and our entire crew. I'm Matt Vaskersian. You've been watching MLB The Show. For more, make your way over to theshownation.com. Our final line score this afternoon. First for the victorious Philadelphia Phillies. Five runs on nine hits. One error. They left seven men on base.